Growing up in a poor family may have its challenges, but it doesn't define your future success. With a willingness to learn and a relentless pursuit of your dreams, you can achieve anything you set your mind to. Remember, every successful person started from somewhere, and many of them came from humble beginnings. So keep pushing forward, keep learning, and never give up on your dreams. Growing up in a poor family may have its challenges, but it doesn't define your future success. With a willingness to learn and a relentless pursuit of your dreams, you can achieve anything you set your mind to. Remember, every successful person started from somewhere, and many of them came from humble beginnings. So keep pushing forward, keep learning, and never give up on your dreams. All right, guys, first of all, let me explain why you should create motivational videos. When it's time to monetize, you wanna earn real money, not just pennies. Motivational videos, especially when combined with fitness motivation or personal finance, can bring in a CPM in the range of $9 to $13. The same applies to combining motivation with technology, which brings us to why you should create motivational videos with AI. The second method may be more time consuming, but it's the safest way to monetize. With that said, let's break down the two methods, starting with the risky one, which is far from weak's method. So why is this method risky? Well, when you use footage that you haven't created yourself and it is not in the public domain, meaning it's not copyright free, then you are relying your monetizing hopes on your knowledge of the fair use law, specifically the transformative and criticism sections of it. Now, it would take too much time for me to talk about it in this video. So I've prepared a PDF file for our brothers and sisters who will choose this way, which they can read thoroughly at their own pace. You can get and read this PDF file by visiting the mega link I will attach in the description. With that said, I will now show you how I created the risky motivational video, where I got the script, the clips, the voiceover, and how I edited them all together. All right, so for the script, I use Perplexity AI. If you can't find it, I will include links for all the AI tools I used in the description. Now, to get the motivational script, I just used this prompt you can see here, and it gave me back this result, which was pretty good, but I didn't use all of it, as you may have noticed. Now, for the voiceover, I used Eleven Labs, which is free, and you can use it by signing up with an email. If you want a voice that suits motivational videos like the one I used, then I've created a tutorial video for you. Instead of me explaining, simply copy what I'm about to show you in this following video. This is an example for my brothers and sisters. Here we are now, addressing the question that concerns most of you. How to get ready to edit anime clips to fit your script. So, I'm going to show you the process and explain how I did it. But you need to understand that it takes time and personal research to find something that matches your script. With that said, let me show you an example. All right, so what you need to do is go to this site called animeclips.online and scroll down a bit. You will then find a large anime collection here where you can randomly click on any of these. After you do that, you will see many clips related to the selected anime. You can also access more anime clips by clicking the clips button here or by searching for one you have in mind. For example, I will search for the No Guns Life anime, which I used in some scenes of my video. Keep in mind that I didn't know any of these anime before, so I was basically searching and downloading clips from different anime that could match my script. And basically, this is what you'll have to do as well. All right, so when you search for an anime, you will see the season folders here. Click on the season you want, and new folders will appear containing episodes from that season. My scenes were from the 11th episode, so I clicked on it, and you can see the clip here.
Now, if you press on the three dots here, you will see an option to select and download all the clips, but this would take a lot of time and space. Instead, hover your mouse over the clip you want to download and click on this small circle, as I'm doing here. This will select the clip, and then go back to the three dots and press the download selected button to download the clip. So, this is the site from which I downloaded all the clips for my risky motivational video. Now, when it comes to editing, I use CapCut. So, after finding and downloading clips that match your script, bring them all together in CapCut. Here, your task is to place each clip in the correct order and timing according to the audio script you previously downloaded from Eleven Labs, ensuring that what is being said in the script matches the clip. These are pretty basic steps, but what makes CapCut so valuable is its auto-caption feature, which automatically adds subtitles to the video. To enable it, simply press the captions button here, choose your language, and hit generate. Once the process completes, the subtitles will appear here, though they are quite basic by default. To make them more engaging and animated like mine, just select all of them. Change the font to something you like. I used ZY Crescent. Scroll down a bit and enable text shadows as well. For subtitle animations, press the animation button here, and from the captions category, choose Word King. That's pretty much it for editing. I didn't use any transitions because, in my opinion, they ruin the flow. Just add a cool fitting music, hit export, and your video is ready. Now that was a pretty fast way to explain CapCut because in my mind, I assume you already know how to use it. However, if most of you don't, write to me in the comments and I will create an in-depth CapCut tutorial video for you guys. With that said, let's continue to the safe method of creating motivational videos with AI in a way that no other YouTuber has shown so far. So if it hasn't worked subconsciously yet, then yes, that meant you should subscribe to my channel to stay ahead of the competition. Anyway, let's see the method. All right, so what you need to do is to go to this site called Pexels. Pexels is a copyright-free platform that offers pictures and videos based on your search. You will notice that sometimes Far From Weeks editors are using clips from this platform as well. So here's an example of how I used Pexels to create the high-quality AI anime motivation video. So. For one of my scenes, I search for Red Bemve and use this clip here. To download it, click on the green free download button, select the full HD option, and then click the download selected size button. Now, what I need you to do is to take the video we downloaded from Pexels and transfer it to CapCut. In CapCut, I need you to select it and scale it down to 80% by dragging this slider to the left. You'll understand later why we needed to do that. So for now, export it as it is. The final step is to go to this site called Go Enhance and sign up for free with an email. After you do that, press the video to video button here. Now you will notice that you have 45 free credits per email. I repeat, you have 45 free credits per email. Emphasis on the per email part. You get what I mean? So what you need to do here is upload the video we exported earlier from CapCut, choose the desired duration, select Anime Style 2 from the styles, and hit generate. Let the tool do its work, and I will see you when it's ready. All right, the process is completed, so let's see the result. As you can see, the result looks pretty good, so go ahead and download it. After downloading it, bring it back to CapCut once more. You will notice that we have a problem here, which is why we scaled the video to 80% in the previous step. So, to fix this problem now, I need you to scale the video up to 125% by moving the scale slider to the right. As you can see, the problem has now disappeared and the clip looks perfect. So this is how I created the AI motivation video, by blending clips that matched my script from Pexels with the Go Enhance tool. The editing process within CapCut remains exactly the same as I demonstrated earlier in the Risky method. Therefore, I will end this video here. I thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.